East have formed a pressure group to convince people that there's plenty of fish in the North Sea. The Real Fish Fight says it wants to counter the impression held by many consumers that fish stocks are still desperately low. One skipper says a recent haul was so big it broke the crane in his boat. Kevin Keane reports. I find it really shocking. The TV presenter Hugh Fernley Whittingstall and his fish fight campaign to save Britain's stocks. But this is what the real fish fight, a group of fishermen in the northeast, say sections of our waters are really like. This haul of mature cod was estimated to weigh 30 tonnes, an illustration they say that the fish is back. Some of the green lobby are actually trying to finish the fishing industry. They're wanting in the North Sea less left of the aquarium, and we just can't have that, you know. We would like the scientists to come out with us and see what we are seeing on the grounds of the recovery. Because I have a fear that the science is not actually keeping up with what the fishermen are saying. This particular catch was so big that it broke part of the boat's crane. This bit is actually goes right into it, so you can see with it being bent... It can't the two trawlers were actually fishing for haddock. This, they say, shows how difficult it is to target just one species of fish. But what environmental groups fear is a return to these bad old days. 2003 and the fish was running out. Dozens of perfectly seaworthy Scottish boats were broken up in this Danish scrapyard. WWF Scotland says cod spawns in large groups and that this catch doesn't reflect populations in the whole sea. The fishing minister is cautiously pleased. That shows the amount of work a fishermen are putting in. And as a result of that, the cod stock is now recovering. It's still got some way to go before it's purely sustainable, but this is a sign that the cod stock is recovering, and that has to be taken into account by Europe in terms of moving forward with the discard ban and future fishing policy. The industry says the fishing has never been so good. This boat is 23 years old, and the skipper says the nets have never caught so much fish. Now they want the politicians to reflect that. Kevin Keane, Reporting Scotland, Peterhead.